Welcome back, Ink Chasers, to another Q&A video. This week's Q&A video is on Olympian Hannah Kearney. She is actually a three-time Olympian, and it um, her event is, I guess it's called Moguls. It's a type of downhill skiing. Um, it's the one where you go around the bumps going down. <laughs> um, she is... Uh, in 2014, she won the bronze medal, and in 2010, she won the gold. And uh, here is the card that I have gotten signed by her. Here's the autograph, and I'll zoom back out so you can kind of see here. And on uh, June 25th, 2014, she fill out the questionnaire so I'll get right to it uh, number one where was your favorite place to compete and as far as I can tell this is R I R E Sweden I'm not too familiar with Sweden so um, that's what I'm reading <laughs> um, number two what was the inspiration for you to become an Olympian my parents if you were not an Olympian, what would you be doing for a living? Cooking. When you were not competing, what do you like to do in your free time? Knit, hike, play with my dog, cook, and organize. What is your favorite book? Uh, Pillars of the Earth. Now, question number six. What, if anything, do you collect? She did not answer. And question number seven. Who taught and helped you the most to become an Olympian? She didn't answer that one either. So on to number eight. What was your favorite uh, event to compete? 2010 Olympics. Redemption. Um, she did compete in 2006 Olympics where she did not medal. And then in 2010, as I mentioned, she won the gold medal. So it was redemption for her. Uh, number nine, who was or is your favorite Olympian? Hard to choose. And then the final question, number 10, what is your most memorable Olympic moment? Tara Lipinski winning gold. Which is odd because I would think that her most memorable moment was her own self winning gold, but it's more memorable for someone else, I suppose. Um... I'll go ahead and do the slow roll for you. And there's the autograph and date. All right. That's our uh, Q&A for today. Um, this one was the last one I have from an Olympian. So it will now just be the uh, actor, actress, and baseball for now on, unless I get something in the mail from an Olympian by then. Um, I know I do have some baseball ones that were in the U.S. Olympics, but I've got those under baseball, so... Um, Alright, as always, like, comment, subscribe, and until next week, thanks for watching.